Hey y'all, this is your girl Jamie here. What is going on guys? How are y'all doing? I hope y'all are having a blessed day. If y'all are new to my channel, welcome, welcome. Hit that subscribe button guys. And y'all know what to do if you like this video. Hey y'all, this is your girl Jamie here. What is going on guys? How are y'all doing? I hope y'all are having a blessed day. If y'all are new to my channel, welcome, welcome. Hit that subscribe button, guys. And y'all know what to do if you like this video.
But I'm pretty sure morphine is what they give to people like cancer patients and stuff who are, you know, dying and stuff. I'm not sure. So I could kind of see her maybe checking out because she, her lawyer saying that she was given from 12, they, they gave her muscle relaxants at 1218. And then they started giving her morphine from 1228. All they gave it to her for 111 minutes, y'all. Now, her lawyer's also stating that they gave her some other medication, which you are not meant to give a pregnant woman, and some other medicine that's for like nausea. So, yeah, the the one it starts with a K is K E T O R O L A C. If y'all wanna you know look it up, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it because you know, yeah, <laughs> like I said, I'm not even gonna bother. But it's a non-steroid anti-inflammatory medication used to treat you know pain. But they're also saying that the baby. came out breathing, you know, as far as like the autopsy and everything. So yeah, this story is definitely going to probably be in the news for quite a little while. And I mean, I don't know, but with the evidence, you know, she secretly is saying that she tampered with the evidence and after secretly delivering the boy in the hospital bathroom. And she's also fouling her lawyers claiming that the hospital staff and city workers violated HIPAA laws by sharing his client's medical records and discussing the case. Hmm, y'all, what do y'all think about this, man? I mean, this, we've all seen the video of her running down and holding her bottom. Yeah, so I don't know, man. Do y'all think this, <clears throat> how do y'all think this is going to turn out in court, man? Because I didn't know about the strangulation. I didn't realize that's what they were also, at some point, they're charging her with that as well. So, I mean, they keep saying that she kept denying ever even having sex. And, you know, I don't know. I, do you think this little girl was just desperate because she didn't want her mama to find out or just a, a master manipulator? I don't know, but there, her classmates were also stating that she named the baby beforehand and that she named him Alex. And then the police, you know, video cam of them going to her house and everything with the warrants and stuff showed like a whole shrine and it said Alex. So, I mean, <clears throat> let me know what y'all think about this down in the comments below and I will put up my other you know, link to the other video I did with all the actual details and everything. But if y'all are new here, hit that subscribe button, guys, and hit the like button. Let me know what y'all think down in the comments below, and I will talk to y'all in my next video. Bye, guys.